The next guest on Smarter San Diego TV is our Santee Community Correspondent, joined by a special guest from Veterans United. Please welcome Daniel Buxer and Chris Carno. Thank What's you up, fellas? How are you awesome. doing? Life is treating us extremely well. All right. Great to have you guys here on the show. Now, Daniel, you wanted to bring Chris on today. Absolutely. Tell us why. Just very excited to have Chris Cano and Veterans United being big partners with us. Um, Chris is extremely passionate about what he does, and no one's out there really helping veterans the way that Chris does. And I'm just extremely um, fortunate to be partnered with great people like Chris Cano and his whole crew as well. Are, they're just absolutely amazing people, and our clients are very fortunate to be able to work with them. Okay. Great awesome. stuff. How's that sound, Chris? That's amazing. Not bad, huh? that's, can I get that in an email? <laughs> frame that. Got it on video. Hey, I need to frame this video somehow. That's from my wall. That's from the heart. Thank you. It's a <laughs> Exactly. Awesome. Chris, yep. I've known about Veterans United since it was Nova Star Financial, okay? However wow. many years ago that was. Yeah. Um, I know the guys who started the company. Mm -hmm. It was all about values from the very beginning. Sure. It's great to have you on the program now so that you can talk about those values, but also help Thanks. us sort of demystify mm -hmm. some of those VA loan myths that might still be out there. Awesome. Well, it's first and foremost a pleasure to be here. Thank you for having us and for the kind uh, introduction. Yeah. That means a lot. Um, our company is based on helping military members and, and the branch network is actually fairly new. Veterans United has been around for a while as you've mentioned, but the branch network concept is fairly new. So okay. getting branch managers and, and getting more out into the community, getting away from kind of the internet company that we started off as, you know, uh, and relating more with the military community, our veterans and whatnot is kind of where we're shifting focus. So being a 10 year sailor, submarine uh, guy out of Pearl Harbor. I said, let's get busy helping these guys. So here I am in San Diego meeting cool guys like Daniel Buxa and Mission Realty nice. Group. So we're having some fun so far. Very cool. Yeah. So are you still, I know at one point you were running the Hawaii Yep, branch, absolutely. Right? Yeah. And are you running both Hawaii and San Diego? Well, I'm the branch manager for Veterans United San Diego. Uh, in Hawaii, I still act as the director of uh, hiring and, and programs. And I'm kind of responsible for the production of both branches. I do sales training with the loan officers. Uh, because we pride ourselves in hiring military members, there's a lot of training that goes into that. We like uh, the men and women who fresh out of the out of the military take off the uniforms and put on a VU polo. Um, so the training curve is, I guess, probably about two to three months longer than your average uh, mortgage individual who's been in the industry for a while. So okay, that makes that's sense. That's my court. And you guys are just doing VA loans, right? 95% of the business we do is VA. It's almost entirely VA. Almost business. entirely, yeah. We, we take a lot of pride in, in making that our focus, so staying sharp in that arena. The conventional FHA, USDA, we do it, but uh, not as well as we do the VA. Let's talk about the VA loan. Sure. Because there's a lot of people, a lot of real estate agents out there, Daniel, right. who don't understand the intricacies of the VA loan. So sure. tell us about some of those myths that you can debunk. Sure. So unfortunately, uh, a lot of military members don't understand the VA because us individuals in the industry don't keep up with it. You're right, back in uh, about even six, seven years ago, the VA wasn't what it is today. And this most recent year, it's gone from 2% to making up 5% of the mortgages that are out there. Wow. So it's more than that's doubling at this pace right quite now. Quite a bit. Wow. Yeah, quite a bit. That's good. That's amazing. It's a fantastic thing, especially because over the last six years, it's been the one program with the least amount of foreclosures. So we have a great group of individuals here financing their homes for 30 years and not defaulting like some of the other programs. Um, not to mention the, the post 9-11 veterans that are getting out right now, they're a younger demographic. Uh, the average age of veterans in America right now is about 64, 65, with less than 1% being under 35 years old. Well, that is shifting tremendously now in, in the generation we're in. And a lot of the members getting out of the military right now are younger, they're going to be home buyers. So, you know, companies like Mission Realty Group, Veterans United, we're, we're getting aggressive with educating these guys and gals, you know, and, and not making the same mistakes that some of our forefathers made and, and not understanding the benefit and utilizing it. So Yeah, and that's the thing because the VA loan is really the best loan out there. I mean, yes. There's nothing that's better than 100%, no MI, sure. et cetera. Sure. Um, but a lot of people think that there's problems with the VA loan. Yeah. That it's, it's hard to get one. It takes a long time. Mm -hmm. uh, They're going to ask for tons of documentation. Is any of that stuff true? Uh, it could be true if you're working with uh, a team that doesn't understand the VA. So what we always encourage our military members to do is, is first and foremost seek out how many VA loans your lender has done in the past, You know what kind of uh, market share they make up, and along with your real estate agent as well, because otherwise the next conversation they're going to have with you is how great the conventional loan is mm -hmm. uh, if they don't specialize in VA. But 
you know, right now we're closing loans right around the 20 day mark, 25 day mark, even with some of the new things with TRID coming out, you know, a lot of the real estate community was getting scared with. I could vouch having three escrows open with Veterans United right now. They are on top of their A game right yeah. now. Awesome. You know, um, well, again, that goes back to the 95% of the business we do being VA. Between Hawaii and San Diego, we'll make up uh, half a billion dollars in VA loans in 2015. <laughs> so we're, we're not, you know, this is an amateur business. hour. This is, uh, this is something we do. So whenever we pass on that knowledge to the loan officers that we hire out of the military, they're taking on that uh, sense of ownership and that pride and, and being the best at what they have. But you're right, a lot of myths out there. A lot of people thinking you can only use a VA home loan once. Uh, a lot of people coming to San Diego reporting freshly thinking, well, I got to refinance at home in Texas or Virginia uh, before I can use it again. Um, that's one thing that we debunk in our, our seminars as well. And, um, you know, just the fact, like you said, the turn times, that's what scares the real estate agents to death. Why would I accept this offer? Right. When, you know, it's going to take so long to close. So um, it's our job for buyers, agents and lenders to make sure that we're educating not just the veteran, but the individuals accepting these contracts. Absolutely. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, I tell you, um, a lot of what would you say? You were a sailor for ten years. Sure. How many people in the military know that the VA loan even exists? Unfortunately, not a lot of us. I don't know what it is, but people think that it's a VA loan for veterans, and they think that veterans are people out of the military. So a lot of my active duty sailors, comrades, mm -hmm. shipmates, uh, Marines, they think that you have to be out of the service to use this product. The truth is, the moment you put on that uniform and you start serving, you are a veteran. You're an active duty veteran, but you're a veteran. Right. Um, so we're not getting educated like we are on the GI Bill, tuition assistance. Um, and the truth be told, our military has government housing. So what good would it really do our military to, to motivate our, uh, our military to buy houses when they do so well recollecting that BAH that they give right. for our individuals to live on post? Not saying that's the that's what they're doing, but it's our jobs to get out there and educate and say, hey, you have an option. Okay, yeah. great stuff. Thank you so much for being here, Chris. Thanks, Derek. Really appreciate Pleasure your Pleasure being here. Thank Absolutely. You this country. Really Thank appreciate you. you. It means a lot. Daniel, great Thank stuff, you, man. Brother. Thanks for being Chris in. Really awesome. appreciate your time. Stick around for more Smarter San Diego TV, where we guarantee to make you smarter than everyone else. Commercial free.